I can't tell you how many times I've heard of, you know, mainly in my field, dentists that they'll sell their, they'll sell their practice, but then the incoming dentist will, won't buy the building. So they just buy the practice and they, and they're leasing the building. And usually it's, it's an, you know, of course, an older dentist moving out, younger dentist coming in. Uh, maybe he does different procedures that the other person doesn't, you know, he's, he has different, different mindset, different things. He, he, you know, nine times out of 10, they grow the practice more. So they outgrow the building. So now they're moving to another location. So, so this dentist that sold his practice, he's just left there with an empty building to sell. So I think that, you know, kind of what you're saying, this would help alleviate that before that guy would have sold his building. You can't maximize value. What, what ends up happening is anyone that wants to buy the real estate is underwriting your new tenant. And let's say your new tenant is fighting you on a length of lease, like a sale lease back, we look for 15 years. Let's say he says, I only want five years. Well, you can cut your value significantly down. If you're able to sell it first and the real estate and then have a prospective buyer and he's got to live by the terms of the new lease, depending on what that is, it makes it so you achieve your value up front. He has a, he's a stable income stream that he knows he's going to be paying to his landlord, it's a win-win. When you get involved and you sell the practice and you still own the real estate, someone's buying your existing lease you create. So if you're not in the business on a full-time value, it's very difficult to create leases that could achieve maximum value. And we create an absolute net lease with our tenants and we do long-term leases with annual escalations. That's how you achieve value. And you need a professional to really step in. You know, I don't, I don't clean my own teeth. I go to a dentist to do that. So everyone's got certain niches and focus in life. And that's why people come to us. We're the experts in dealing with medical properties and tenants like doctors, dentists, you name it. And that's why you do it. And we kind of align ourselves with the doctors shoulder to shoulder so they can achieve maximum value. And in turn, we want ability to have a stable income stream.